The Times of Education. Date, 19th of December, 2019. Fast tag, Proud and Montri Gramsad Dak Yojana, Ps, Ek Berat Shrista Berat, Gohi Liberation Day, Sahatya Akademi Awards, Exam Warriors. Fast tag. Why in News Colon Sri Night Gabkari released TV awareness campaign on Fast Tag starring renowned sign actor Sri Akshay Kumar. What is it? Fast Tag is a refit passive tag used for making toll payments directly from the customer's link prepaid or savings, current account. It is affixed on the windscreen of the vehicle and enables the customer to drive through toll plazas, without stopping for any toll payments. The toll fare is directly deducted from the linked account of the customer. Fasttag is also vehicle specific and once it is affixed to a vehicle, it cannot be transferred to another vehicle. Fasttag can be purchased from many of the net member banks. If a Fasttag is linked to the prepaid account, then it needs to be recharged slash topped up as per the usage of the customer. If adequate balance is not maintained by the customer, the fast tag gets blacklisted at the toll plaza. In such a scenario if the customer travels through a toll plaza without recharging then he won't be able to avail the net services and would be required to pay the toll fare through cash. Exam Warriors Written by Prime Minister Why in News Colon Shri Thawar Kanjahlat releases Braille edition of book Exam Warriors Written by Prime Minister what is it colon Union Minister for Social Justice and Empowerment Shri Thawar Kanjahlat released the Braille edition of the book Exam Warriors authored by Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi here today. The Braille edition in Hindi and English has been prepared in the Braille press of Rajasthan Natrahin Kalyan Sang. This release of Braille edition of Exam Warriors is taking place at an opportune time when exams of secondary and higher secondary standards are fast approaching. All the pictures of the book have been well described for the benefit of blinds readers. Proud and Montri Gramsad Dak Yojana Why in News, Union Minister for Rural Development Sri Narendra Singh Tomar inaugurates Phase 3 of Proud and Montri Gramsad Dak Yojana to further enhance connectivity of villages with hospitals, schools and agricultural markets. Ministry, Department, Ministry of Rural Development MGZI aims at consolidation of 1,25,000 km through routes and major rural links that connect habitations to gram and agricultural markets, grams, higher secondary schools and hospitals with an estimated cost of Rs. 80,250 crores, central share of Rs. 53,800 crores, for the period 2019-20-2024-25. Tripura gets its first s. The Ministry of Commerce and Industry has notified the setting up of the first ever Special Economic Zone SEZ, in Tripura on December 16, 2019. This is being set up at Paskim Jalfa, Sabroom, South Tripura District, which is 130 kilometers away from Agartala. It will be a sector-specific economic zone for agro-based food processing rubber-based industries, textile and apparel industries, bamboo and agri-food processing industries will be set up in this. After it is set up, 100% income tax exemption will be provided on export income for SIS units under Section 10 of the Income Tax Act for the first five years. Ek Berat Shrista Berat Why in News, Indian Railways offers 50% concession for youth participating in the Ek Berat Shrista Berat program. The event is organized to showcase the spirit of Ek Berat Shrista Berat. It promotes communication and artistic skills of students through various competitions. The students will prepare their own projects and exhibits on customs, dress, agriculture, economy, climate and topography. This will act as a good platform for the children to understand the art and culture of the states. The event will also help the children overcome linguistic and geographical barriers and awaken a strong sense of national pride and widen their horizons with better cosmopolitan outlook. The regions will prepare exhibits based on theme Fit India, Swak Bharat, ban on single-use plastic, etc. Gohi Liberation Day Gohi Liberation Day is celebrated on 19 December every year. 
the Portuguese colonized India in 1510. By the end of the 19th century, Portuguese colonies in India were limited to Goa, Bayman, Diu, Dadra, and Nagarhavli which were collectively known as Astadod of India. In 1961 an armed action code named Operation Vijay by the Indian Armed Forces was carried out to remove Portuguese administration from Goa. The operation involved air, sea and land strikes for over 36 hours, and was a decisive victory for the Republic of India, ending 451 years of rule of Portugal. Many organizations were started to liberate Goa. Some of these organizations were Azadgumantik Dal, the United Front of Goans, the Goa Liberation Council, the Goan People's Party, and the Quit Goa Organization. In 1987, Goa became a full-fledged state within the Indian Union. Sahatya Akademi Awards Why in news, Sahatya Akademi announces annual Sahatya Akademi Awards in 23 languages today. Seven books of poetry were awarded. Four novels were awarded. Three books of essays were awarded. Six books of short stories were awarded. Dr. Shashi Tharoor, An Era of Darkness, English, Dr. Vijaya Kanada, Professor Shafi Kid Y, Yurdu, Nonfiction, Autobiography and Biography respectively. Please like share comment subscribe and don't forget to hit bell icon to never miss an important update. Thank you.